Hey, how's it going guys? Destry here from DestryMoonies.com and in today's video, I just wanted to talk to you about the 7 Habits of Highly Effective People. It's a book written by Stephen Covey and it's actually been made into a course that I'm actually going through right now as a, for training on how to become more effective when it comes to your your work environment. So habit number one is to be proactive. You want to be able to take a look at the things that you need to take care of and rather than being reactive, take steps to to plan ahead of time in order for you to, to be proactive about it rather than react to a situation well, when it actually does come up. Uh, habit number two is to, to begin with the end in mind. You have to have a clear vision of what you're looking to accomplish and what kind of outcome you're looking to, uh, to do before you even begin to, to take steps in that direction. So if you have a clear and concise uh, end game in mind, you'll be a lot more effective to, to solve things or to get something accomplished if you already know what the end and outcome would be. So habit number three is to put first things first. Um, he, Stephen Covey talks about putting your, your big rocks first, meaning take care of your, your larger priorities and set some time and schedule it accordingly before um, handling the the little things that come in life, like um, you know, any s small emails or customer visits or things that just pop up throughout the week that you don't have to take care of right away, but it is important. Habit number four is to to think win win. So you want to think of a way in order for you and your customer to both win in that scenario. Uh, habit number five is actually one of my, my favorites, is to, to seek first to understand, then to be understood. So when you're getting to know uh, a customer or someone that you're trying to help, it's better to ask questions uh, to seek to understand uh, their point of view than to try to explain your point of view and have them follow what you're saying. So you have to determine what your your customer's needs are before trying to provide a solution. Uh, habit number six is to synergize. So you need to be able to work together with other people creatively in order to, to accomplish um, a solution, accomplish a goal or something that you set out to do. And habit number seven is to sharpen the saw. So this is to, it's a rejuvenating um, aspect of the seven habits where you just continually go through these habits and to continually improve yourself in order for you to to become a better person and a better and um, a more effective individual when it comes to building your business or getting to know your customers so this training class has been very valuable to me and I hope that um, what I have to share with you guys from this training class helps you too while you're building your businesses online. If you get value from this video, make sure that you comment down below and make sure that you join my newsletter for more valuable information like this. So that's what I had to share with you guys today. Hope you get some value from it and I'll catch you guys in another video.